The fragrance is super important. Yeah. The look doesn't matter. Yeah. It does, I but I like it. Yeah. <laughs> the fragrance is not important. Is it worth it to spend a lot of money in a fragrance? Today's video, I'm going to ask women what fragrance do they prefer. And I'm going to compare a cheap one from Sarah, my own fragrance, one of my own fragrances, and Krita Ventus. So let's see what women prefer. Do you have any favorite fragrance that you like for a man? Oh, I can't remember which one it is, but one of the Versace colognes. I think the Dior one's good, isn't it? The Dior colognes? Yeah, the Dior one's good. And even the Versace. There's not like a specific one where I'm like, that's the best one. No, it depends, Tobacco, on, the, depends <laughs> on the season, actually. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So now if you don't mind to smell these three different fragrances, which one do you prefer? More like sandalwood, something like sandalwood sandal a little okay. bit. Yeah, yeah. Definitely more masculine. Okay. Then we have the second one. I think the first. 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 Yeah. The first. This one. First and the second, but first, first, first. first. I like this that one, one as well. well yeah. I would also say the same. Yeah, the same. <laughs> okay. Do you prefer things for like a Palaman, like more sweet or more oud or leather? I like oud as well. Yeah, oud okay. or not too sweet. Yeah, I, prefer the second one. the second one. Yeah. Okay. It's very nice. Cool. Perfect. So that's the winner. What kind of uh, brand is it? I love Chanel and Azora too. Sarah. Yeah. This one actually is from Sarah. Oh. Yeah, it's a B brand leather. Ooh, B brand leather. I like kind of the the last one is like a little bit. I don't want to say like lighter, but like it's not. I don't like it when like like the smell is smell is like really overpowering. And that okay. one just like you know sometimes when you like walk past someone and you get hit with like oh my god that's so strong. That's what I like with the last one. But definitely those two. So you want to know which one is it? Yeah. 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 Great <laughs> <laughs> Aventus. This one. Great. Great uh, Aventus. Okay, yeah. yeah. From Sarah. B brand leather. So I, I, I need you need to choose one. Do you for me okay. this one? Yes, this one. Which one? This one? Yeah. Do you think it's more important, fragrance or outfit for a man? Both, but fragrance, yeah. You should smell good. Yeah, yeah. You should, you should smell good. Yeah. Okay, but if you need to choose one, fragrance. Mm. Probably fragrance. Fragrance? Yeah. You all agree? Yeah. <laughs> you agree with everything. Okay. Outfit. Outfit. Yes. 100%. Outfit. Outfit. <laughs> this one is from Sarah. And it's B brand leather. Ooh. The one that you choose is Sarah. Oh, it's, that's my name. Yeah. No, it's you did brand. Oh, okay, Sarah. cool. Yeah. <laughs> Outfit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> outfit. It outfit. has to be outfit. Smell good. Smell good. Yeah. Smell, smell good. good. I mean, because if it's really bad and they smell great, <laughs> it's not. Yeah. You know, yeah. Sure I'd want them fine. to smell nice. Yeah. I think that's the thing. I'd want them to wear cologne. Wear <laughs> cologne. Yeah. Even if it's wearing like a dry suit. <laughs> yeah. I think smell is such a big thing for me. Oh, okay. The look doesn't matter. Yeah. It does. I like it. Yeah. 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 And what about the last one? I think this one's my least favorite. I think it's the most faint as well. The fragrance is super important. Yeah. Okay. Super. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if he doesn't smell bad, because you can yeah. wear a fragrance or you can have nothing. Yeah. And if he doesn't smell bad, so it's then. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Out. It's outfit for sure. I'd say like a nice balance, but like if you. Yeah, I know that both. Clothes. I know yeah. that both are important, but, obviously. Yeah. But if you need to choose one. Yeah. Okay. And actually, this video is to show that you don't need to spend a lot of money. Oh, yeah, yeah, to smell yeah. light. Yeah. Okay. Because so Sarah try. and this, this book, is this, one? this is like 20 pounds. Wow. And this one is even less mm -hmm. than Sarah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh. Cool. Good to know. And don't get me wrong, this video is not to prove that you need to go and buy the cheapest fragrance of the market. This video is actually to show you that you don't need to go for the prestige of the brands or the hype of any fragrance because maybe you're going to think oh all the girls are going to love this fragrance all the girls like the fragrance from sarah which is the cheapest one, actually of the market one of the cheapest of the market but it's not going to last long actually you need to focus on yourself which fragrance is the one that you like and usually from my experience the ones that are from big brands, the prestigious brands, they are making like cheap, cheap or bad quality fragrances that could be similar to the one from Sara. I know that there are a lot of fragrances, but I do prefer go for things more like small companies like this one for Penhaligons, Endymion 
which is really nice. I like how it smells. It's like a mix of sandal with suede with a lot of different things and it's lasting quite long. I mean, it's not crazy long, but it's good. It's good for a daily basis or I mean for special occasions. And I have and I have had a lot of different fragrances for different brands, different companies. At the moment, the one that I like a lot and I'm using a lot is this one, Ecre Noir. And actually I got to a lot of compliments from girls saying that yeah they like this one maybe they do prefer the one from Zara but the question is are you buying fragrances for someone else or for yourself go for things go for fragrances go for clothes that you like and usually go for brands that are in the middle skip the ones that are fast fashion and skip the ones that are only the logo and the prestigious, you know, this kind of things that they are only selling the logos and the branding. By the way, I know that I've been busy and it's been a long time since my last video, but I've been traveling, I've been in Portugal, now in Madrid, I've been in factories checking how my, my clothes are made, the clothes of my brand. And if you're interested in that kind of things, I can also upload these videos in in this channel in English because I made that one for in Spanish but if you are interested in how my own brand is growing in Spain I know that it's funny though but if you are interested and also if you want to check that videos you can check them in my Spanish YouTube channel but maybe I'm going to upload some of that videos here in English as well thanks for watching and I'll see you next time